This flash gas compressor system is aboard the Liza Destiny floating production storage and offloading FPSO vessel operating in the Stabrook Block offshore Guyana. The flash gas compressor malfunctioned in January, resulting in ExxonMobil's increase in natural gas flaring above pilot levels to maintain safe operations. Subsequently, the faulty flash gas compressor was removed and sent abroad for repairs. In an update to members of the media in May, Public and Government Affairs Advisor at ExxonMobil Guyana, Janelle Prasad, related that repairs and upgrades to the third stage discharge silencer were ongoing. The damaged gas compressor was reinstalled in April, but it was subsequently discovered that there was another problem with the discharge silencer. Resultantly, the oil company significantly reduced its production to just 30,000 barrels. Operations had ramped up back subsequently. The silencer is a key component of the flash gas compression system. In an update provided in May, Persaud said that the repairs were reportedly being progressed by Man Energy Solutions, the equipment's manufacturer, at a facility in Houston, Texas. In that update as well, Persaud also stated that the manufacturer of the redesigned third-stage discharge Venturi has been completed and it was being shipped to Guyana. On Friday, Persaud said that this newly upgraded equipment was currently being reinstalled. The team remains on track to complete reinstallation and startup of the flash gas compressor later this month. We're hoping that this can be done by, by the middle of June. Passard also noted that the company continues to safely manage flare levels of the natural gas to less than 15,000 standard cubic feet per day, which is a volume of measurement for gas. Reporting for the newsroom, I am Vishani Ragbir.